$2.19. She does these spins. And then she sits. You have to sit, Lily. Sit like a nice lady. Very good. Okay. Don't mind Lily crunching back there. <laughs> I wanted to make like a little spooky um, pumpkin spice latte. Just for no reason. Just to make it festive. Okay, we have our coffee here, and we'll pour this in. Turn this off to be safe. And then, let's see. I wanna take some whipped cream. Normally I do non-dairy, but it's okay. I just have this, I do a little bit of it. Ooh, like that. And then, of course, some sprinkles. And I just opened up these, so. We'll do some of those. Oh, that's cute. Now let's do the little ball ones too. To mix it up. Cute. So festive. I forgot my cream art. <laughs> alright, that's alright. Beautiful folly morning light in my backyard. Ah, oh, makes me so happy. You guys are in my office right now. Um, it's a little wild. We have some fall decorations I'm going to swap out and then like I'm sitting next to my orders behind me. <laughs> like, yeah, my sewing machine up here. So this is like where I create all my stuff for my Etsy shop. If you're interested in checking it out, I'll have a link below. Um, Candy Pants Clothing on Etsy. And I make like dresses and scarves and like accessories, a lot of gifty stuff. So if it's a perfect time around that holiday season if you want to go check that out. So today I just wanted to do my little trick-or-treater bags with you guys because I every year I make little baggies full with like goodies and stuff for trick-or-treaters. So I thought that'd be fun to do with you guys. So let's see, what do I have in here? I actually got this and a bunch of the stuff, like these little baggies from the 90s basically, like from a yard sale and I was so happy to find them. There's like these, um, let's see, what else did she give me? They're all like 50 cents. Like, look at these. Oh my God. A bunch of these bags. Like, I'm never gonna have to buy trick-or-treat bags for kids. I found these at Joann's. They're like Swedish Fish, Sour Patch Kids. I'm gonna put these in. And then little gummy bears for the kids and airheads. And little, uh, what are these? Little mini pens. Hi, Lily. Oh, and I have a little cat. <laughs> put this on now. Little kitty ears. Why not? Hi, baby. And I found a heart. I don't know what I'm going to do this for. Oh, I was using it for Valentine's Day, like a picture or something, I think. Yeah, that's probably what I did. Uh, okay. And I also, my sister found me this. I was trying to find this last year and I couldn't. She found me and got it. I see candy in your future. So I like hang this on the door when the trick-or-treaters come. Oh well, yeah, I found these too. Like she gave me so many, like in this for like 50 cents. Like look at these from the 90s. Oh my god. And look at this one. Oh, so cute. Oh my god. Look, this one's like not even opened. It says 1995 on it. Oh my gosh. I love them. And then another little pack of the spiders. So I have so many. And I just like I like to switch it up. Oh, Lily. Excuse me. Excuse me, Lily. Excuse me, Lily. Where do I start? Okay, I'm very excited. I'm just gonna open up the candy and like lay them all out in front of me. I feel like that's gonna be easier. Garbage. Airheads. Okay. We got our candy laid out here. A little baggie. <clears throat> a Sour Patch Kid. A little pen. And then I have to like twist them shut. I think, yeah, here's this one twisty. I don't have many twisties. Oh, let's do more than that though. Let's do like two and a gummy bear. Oh no, how about um, an airhead? Yeah, and a pen. Okay, which other one should we use though? You wanna do this one? You like this one? Oh, you like that one, okay. Let's do this one. So oh, cute and 90s-y. Okay. Oh, there's so many, good. There's twisties in here. I saved them. <laughs> I saved some from last year. No. This one says 1988 down in the corner. Oh my God. There's 
so cool. She kept them for so long. I was so lucky to find this yarn sale. I found it on like Facebook Marketplace. Staple. I was just thinking, would you guys want me to do like clean, like organize with me videos? Cause I kind of like watching those. I think those are really like relaxing, but um, I don't know. Cause this office could definitely use it. And I was thinking maybe after Halloween, like when things start to slow down a little, we could do an organizing video if you guys want to. Let me know what you think. If you like those videos or if it's not really your thing, like, I'd like to know, please. Oh my god, this one's from 1999. Oh my god, they're so cute. Okay, we have all our candy ready for the kids. Oh my god, this makes me so happy. Look how cute. I know it's like probably not okay to film other people's children, but it would. I just love seeing their costumes. I'm not gonna put them on the internet. I'm gonna take my ears off now. Okay, we have our little baggies all ready to go for the kids. I try to keep them like designed together, and I wanted to fill them all up pretty to the brim so that everybody be happy. <laughs> Lily paws. I just popped Casper on and I added these cute little lights. I feel like that like amplifies the spooky Halloween movie experience. <laughs> and then I'm gonna light everybody up later and we'll take a picture. Just got done doing my nails and I did like a little vampy witchy color M I C what's this called? Manhattan. Um and that was this one. Nailed it. I don't even know where this is from. I think it's like you know what it is? Called Dreamy Eyes. But it's pretty sure it's from like I'm about to take a spooky shower. I've got my cauldron going, my crystal ball. I'm ready to relax Halloween style. <laughs> Morning guys, it's Vlogtober day 20 and I have my little pumpkin bottoms on, <laughs> not matching top, and these little slippers I got from Shein. My whole like coffee area is so spookified <laughs> in my water. My little kitchen witch. So this morning we're gonna do banana caramel crepes for breakfast. Um, I have this caramel, it's really good. It's like my favorite one I tried. Salted caramel smuckers, and then I just have some ready, ready whip. I'm doing almond milk in it, and then I will put it together and we'll see how it turns out. <laughs> I've made crepes so many times that I feel like I can just like eyeball this. <laughs> It's also, okay, so you just do that, like a little bit of that, the salt. It's like a certain consistency you're looking for, basically. An egg. Vanilla. Whisk all that together. Made quite a mess. And now we're gonna spray the pan. There's nothing in there. <laughs> Hopefully I have a backup. Spray the pan. Take some, put it in there a little bit and put it here on the paper towel because it gets so messy. And move it around. I'm gonna add a little more. See, I don't really care that it's lumpy. <laughs> I know it's like you take your time, it's not supposed to be lumpy, but I don't really care. I get hungry in the morning and I just wanna eat it. So, <laughs> like just a little, a little tiny like tan. For the most part, you don't want it to be like burned. Beautiful. It's just like slightly, slightly tanned. Okay, so we have this one done. I'm just gonna put some caramel on it and some bananas. Okay, I just added a little bit of drizzle of caramel and then we just roll it over. Roll it, roll it, roll it. Like Limp Biscuit. Older people will get that joke. The only thing with crepes is that you have to move fast because they easily burn and you don't want them to be burned. So then 
Um, I just have everything like laid out for me, ready to go. I have my paper towel, like, cause I, I just done, done this so many times. I know the drill. Get on there. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> do, do, do. I'm gonna put a little banana on top. <laughs> I just wanted to show you guys that my front door is, that what's happening on my front door right now. The ghosties, I have a projector. Right here we have these little guys flashing away. But then my mother-in-law gave me this guy. <laughs> so I stuck him out here. And then these bats, this was a wreath that I made. It's all the, be the bats and extra little picks and then I, I stuck some lights on there. <laughs> Good morning guys. It is Vlogtober day 21. I'm just about to go get some, I just ordered my coffee, my, or my chai tea latte, my iced chai. I'm about to go pick it up. I'm going to take you guys like shopping with me. I'm going to try some stuff on. I can't believe we only have, what is it? 10 days to Halloween. Like, I feel like this time has flown by, but we have lots of stuff planned for after Halloween and like all throughout the year. So stick with me if you like my stuff. I've been really busy on Etsy. Like I um, you guys have been ordering my Carrie dress a lot, the Carrie costume. Um, so I've been buying fake blood constantly and like tons of rolls of yards of white fabric. What have you guys been watching? I just started watching Squid Games and I watched the first um, episode and it was it hooked me in. I tried to get into the second one and I haven't like finished it yet. I want to go back and try to actually finish the season because everybody loves it. So um, that's what I'm watching now. I tried to watch Anoja last summer, this series. Um, and I'm a huge I Know What You Did Last Summer fan, the movie from the 90s. So I was like, you know what, I'll go into it and I'll just, I'll just be open mind. We'll, we'll see how it goes. And I'm not so, um, I kind of feel like it's more like, I love Euphoria. Like it's like Euphoria mixed with like a CW teenage show and some murders, you know? I don't know. Not, unfortunately not into it. Ice chai tea coming for me. Let's go in and get our tea. Okay, we've got our iced chai tea latte. I got it with almond milk. What can you see? Almond milk, two pumps chai instead of the three because I feel like it's too sweet. He's like fall. So I think we're gonna go to um, Home Goods. I have to go to Walmart to get some materials for our orders. I wanted to go to Adams. Adams is a a like kind of farmhouse, kind of like Whole Foods, basically like earthy farm made. <laughs> um, things. And I want to see if they have anything Halloween-y there for us. Wait, Megan the Stallion has hottie sauce from Popeyes? What is that? I want that. I'm going to try that. Okay, I might try that with you guys at some point. I guess we'll walk across because there's like, I'm in like a plaza where they have like a, a Old Navy, Home Goods, DSW, and Barnes and & Noble. And I kind of feel like going to Barnes and & Noble just for mm, end gigs, you know. Okay, let's go. I didn't see this one. 
when I last came to Target, this little tea, the Day of the Dead Sugar Skull tea is so cute. And then I just found this little pleated plaid skirt. It's pretty cute. Okay, this like silky black dress. It's actually not too bad. I found it in this color too, but it's like, doesn't look right. <laughs> I like this one. Not too bad. This one's definitely like kind of busy, but <laughs> it's pretty. I like the cut. I feel like if I found this dress in a top. Well, we're back to loosen layers because it's 75 degrees again on October 21st. I'm just gonna take you guys to a grocery store quick that I have that I was talking about Adams. Okay guys, I am home. Lily's growling at somebody walking by. Um, I lost most of my lipstick because I ate a Italian sub. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm just gonna be hanging out for the rest of the day. I'm working a little bit on some orders. And I think for now, I'm gonna close out my vlogtober vlogoween day 21 so i will see you guys in the next one